Hey guys, welcome back. Today I have a haul. I know I don't do a lot of hauls, but I have one. If you don't like hauls, I'm sorry. I get a lot of flack or slack or I don't know. I get a lot of like hate that I kind of do a lot of hauls, but for a disclaimer for this video, since people hate my hauls, I bought this like during um, Black Friday and Cyber Monday. And since the post office and UPS have been like the Pony Express because they probably are getting a ton of orders, I just got them literally like the, in like the past two days. So a lot of the stuff was on sale seems like a lot but it's not because it was on sale does that make sense no it doesn't first thing that I want to discuss with you before I get into my haul is this is probably my most asked question over anything else and that is what lashes I'm wearing I probably get that question two or three times a video and I always say they're from Walmart but I forget the name of them and I don't know why I forget because I wear them every video and the ones that I wear every day are from Walmart you can only I believe get them at Walmart they're always sold out online and I think for eBay right now they're going for like $20 and a pack like this is $8 and they're the Salon Perfect and they're the 615s so if you need to screenshot this or something do it but I'm out of them I'm gonna right now <laughs> so uh but yeah they are the salon perfect 615s and i hope that helps you okay so let's move into the makeup actually let me start out with clothes because i always start out with makeup and maybe for like a first time we can start out with clothes this pair i got was from nike and these are the women's free rn i actually got my husband a pair uh, for christmas as well and they i love them i got them off of Foot Locker, and that's what these look like. I think they they retail for one thirty, and they were like twenty five percent off. But what I love is that they're white, but they're not really white, so they might not show dirt right away. And I love just the knit detailing. Oh my gosh! And they are so incredibly comfortable. I have a size nine. I always go up in my gym shoes, and I were, was wearing these around the house, and they felt like slippers. They are incredibly incredibly comfortable lightweight and then I got a pair of Tim's so I have the beige color in these and I just wanted to pretty much be in a Jay-Z video and get these but I don't I think this would look really cute with like a sweatshirt and a pair of um, really dark blue jeans I just think that that would be so I don't know stylish I'm obsessed with these the glancy they're really comfortable you have to go up a half a size because they run a little bit small so these are a nine and that's what I are and that's what I am in the other pair and I love them and I got these at Macy's when they they had their friends and family sale okay next thing on the agenda I did get a, another Rebecca Minkoff purse I had a online Bloomingsdale credit and oh my gosh you guys this is the coolest color it's not cool because it's pretty basic but I'm kind of like the, the one who just has gray and black in their closet and that's it. But this is the exact same purse as the other one without the fringe. Uh, what is this called? The Regan Satchel Tote. And it's like this blush black color. I think just exclusive at Bloomingdale's and I am obsessed with it. It smells really good. It is super soft and it has all these pockets. It has, it has a ton of pockets in here, and I just think the color is so gorgeous. And it's actually not that expensive. I really like these purses, and um, they're so well made for the price. Clothes. So I actually, these were on sale at Nordstrom for like twelve dollars, and I got the wrong size. They're normally forty. Really, they're normally forty bucks. That's really weird because right now they're on right now the brand new ones are 20, which that is totally worth it. But this is on sale for 12. We love these halter bras, but I got a medium, and this is the problem when you have fake tits, and this is like hashtag fake tit problems, is that the large is too big around here but fits my cup size perfectly. But this is kind of too small here, but fits really well here for the medium. So and I don't want to like go get it hemmed and be like, hey, can you hem my bra? Like, it's kind of uncomfortable, but if you want something to be really cute underneath a shirt or a tank top, these are where it's at. Okay, so these pants are so incredibly comfortable that I had to get two pair. I got a one in black, and this is the one in tan. And these are the Moo Moo. Show me your Moo Moo. That's the brand. 
and I know you guys like want me to do like a try on it's just so hard I'm just kind of lazy for like the setup I just need to figure that out um, they are incredibly long incredibly long and they're bell bottomy they have like this suede type material and I mean if you are 5'9 5 5'10 5 if you're like a woman and you're really super tall and you can't find pants that are tall enough these are for really really tall girls so I'll have to hem like, hem like five inches off at least but that's okay because they're in, they feel like you're wearing sweats but they're stylish so I got these in this color and in black the top this free people mercury top I thought would be really cute I and mean, you're not gonna be able to tell because of the light but it has kind of like the bat wing underneath the sleeve and here's kind of a short sleeve it's fitted through here fitted through the waist and I will put the link below so you can see it on the model but I thought that would be kind of a really cute combination so these hats are the most comfortable beanies they are lined with fleece so basically you're not going to get like an itchy head and I hate to have like wear beanies and have it just itch the whole time so uh, I had got it in black and I think I want to get it in gray as well because who doesn't want a fleece lined beanie okay the second question that i get asked and i got asked a lot on instagram is where i got this cute panda no it's not a panda it's a polar bear this is from wild fox you can get it at bloomingdale's wild fox it's incredibly comfortable i love him with like the rosy cheeks oh my gosh like i just i'm obsessed with this so I wanted to show that uh, you can get it at a variety of websites. If you just type in Wild Fox Polar Bear Sweatshirt in Google, like a ton of sites will come up. But I will link it below for you so you don't have to do the work. Three people I got was a bodysuit. And this is like, this is again was on sale and it just is a really deep v-neck bodysuit. So it shows some nice cleavage from Nordstrom and it's from the brand Hinge and I love their stuff. But if you guys can see, it's like, a grayish rainbow type color oh I love it so the back is kind of open and split and it hangs a little bit lower and then you it, this is a boat neck so it's gonna show off um, like your neckline kind of nice and the sleeves are belled and I just love it I love how there's like it's gray but when you look really closely it's like rainbow I Instagrammed a picture of this if you don't follow me on Instagram you have to follow me because that's usually where I do like the most like where I kind of interact with you guys and snapchat so I'll link those uh two things below I'm not kidding you bought this strictly for the name because I'm in like I'm thinking to myself it can't smell bad I mean how can this smell bad what got me to buy it is I was in anthropology looking to buy this perfume but they were sold out and we were kind of I was going to order it online and we were going through the perfumes that anthropology sells and she says every time they stock this in the store it sells out in like a day of the mermaid 01 perfume and it smells like orange blossom that's probably the best way I could describe this and then I got the body oil and this smells like a mixture of oranges and the beach so this is more of like the beachy it's like oranges meets the Bobbi Brown beach oil type thing and then my sweet friend Teresa told me about this perfume and she says she always gets compliments I am very picky when it comes to perfume and this is called Leela Lou. It's by Rosie Jane and it's called Leela Lou, I think. And this, oh my gosh, this smells like jasmine. If you are like a jasmine, very clean floral lover, you will love this. I'm just kind of like sensitive when it comes to scents. So those by far are like amazing. And then this. So this is by Shiseido. This is the Ibuki Beauty Sleeping Mask. My friend Carly told me about this. She's like, have you tried this sleeping mask? It Basically, you wake up and your skin is super radiant, and this is only 40 bucks. I used it last night, and I woke up, and my skin was like even and soft and just kind of brightened. That's probably the first thing that I noticed how even it was, but it was also super bright. I don't think you're going to be able to tell, but if you look closely, do you guys see those like capsules in there? It's like little, little, it's like little itty bitty um, 
capsules that when you put it on your face it just bursts open and that is the vitamin c that's kind of infused in the sleeping mask to really help your skin be even and brightened and out of all the things that shiseido has i think this abuki line is pretty legit like they make really good stuff and if you're looking for a sleeping mask that's not that's under 50 bucks hello this is 40. i also got three of these mac Inten lip intensity lipsticks which i've never tried before so the first one is called driftwood oh that's the packaging oh this is nice that's kind of like a light purple oh these are really nice that's driftwood dough let's try this one that's the color dough i like how they have the color on the outside of the packaging. I mean, could I take longer to get that sentence out? Me likey. And then the last one is toast and butter. Okay, so this is kind of like a brown, a little bit of like a darker nude. That's kind of like a dark nude brown. I really like that. Oh, hi. Thank you. Did, uh, did you put two raw sugars? Mm -hmm. oh, to do that thing to you to not. Did you, did you go to the one in Kroger? There's more in front of the Home Depot. I know. It's like, I know. It backed out the door. Nuh-uh. Okay. Ulta, and I saw these blushes for, I think, Katri what is Catrice? It's like a new like drugstore line. And I think this is like $2.99 or $3.99. And oh my gosh, this is called I Am Nuts About You. So that, oh, I love this color. It's like a nude rose. Oh, oh my gosh, I'm obsessed. And it's super pigmented. That is Nuts About You, yes. Okay, last two things from Ulta. I finally, they restocked the Tarte Shape Tape Concealer, so I got the shade Light. I also got one for my friend for Christmas. Never tried this concealer. It's one of the best concealers I've ever tried. I'll put the link below, but they're probably sold out. So this is, it seems like it's really light. But I really like the applicator because it's pretty big. And then lastly, I wanted to try this Juice Beauty Phyto Pigments Illuminating Primer. I heard my friend Alex Garza talk about this. It was in her winter, uh, her winter essentials uh, video, and or may, no, I don't know if it was like winter essentials or winter like best things for dry skin. It's illuminating. So let's just see here. Ooh, it's kind of like very lightweight doesn't have a smell and it just probably hydrates like a nice hydration type thing and just illuminates. That's really pretty. So I will let you guys know about that. Let's see how this works. It wasn't that expensive, but I want to try that out. So that is all for today's video. Don't forget to like and subscribe and follow me on social media so you can keep up with my crazy life and I will see you guys next time. Bye.